Welcome back to Explaining Everything, the channel where we dive into the stories and mysteries behind everyday things. Today's question comes from one of our curious viewers, Monkey Head Mikey. Thanks for the suggestion, Mikey. You asked, what is Monel and how is it made? Monel sounds like a fancy French dessert, but it's actually one of the toughest, most corrosion-proof metals ever made. It's strong, stubborn, and basically allergic to rust, like stainless steel's tougher cousin who bench presses ship parts. So grab your safety goggles and your inner metallurgist, because today we're finding out how humans created a metal that refuses to quit right here on Explaining Everything. So, what is Monel? Monel is an alloy, basically a metallic smoothie. Its main ingredients are nickel and copper, with small sprinkles of iron, manganese, silicon, and carbon to fine-tune its strength. The most common type Monel 400 is about 63% nickel and 28 to 34% copper, with trace amounts of the rest. That mix gives it a superpower. It barely rusts, even when soaked in seawater or acid. If most metals are like students who forgot their homework in the rain, Monel is the kid who laminated his notes. The name Monel comes from Ambrose Monel, president of the International Nickel Company in the early 1900s. But trademark law said you couldn't trademark full names, so they dropped one L, hence Monel, a humble brag disguised as branding. Monel was created around 1905 by Robert Crook Stanley at Inco. By 1906, it was patented and quickly became famous for its toughness. It could handle salt water, acids, and extreme heat, basically anything that would make other metals cry. But how exactly do you make something this indestructible? Making Monel starts with, you guessed it, nickel and copper. Both are mined from the earth, often from sulfide or oxide ores, then refined until they're more than 99% pure. Nickel usually comes from Canada or Australia, and copper from Chile, the US, or Peru. Here's the cool part. Nickel and copper already get along in nature. There's even a natural mineral mix of the two called nickelite, which inspired the idea for Monel. I-N-C-O basically said, let's copy what nature's doing, but better. Once refined, the metals are melted together in a furnace that reaches around 1,350 degrees Celsius, 2,460 degrees Fahrenheit, hot enough to make your oven cry. Then come the extras, a touch of iron and manganese to boost strength, plus silicon and carbon to remove impurities. Think of them as the seasoning that perfects the recipe. When everything's blended just right, the molten metal is poured into molds and cooled into solid blocks called ingots. And when those solidify, congratulations, you've got Monel, a silvery, nearly indestructible hunk of metal that laughs at rust. Now that we've made Monel, it's time to toughen it up. Monel can be rolled forged, or drawn into wire, though it's so hard it often eats cutting tools for breakfast. It's a work-hardening metal, meaning the more you shape it, the stronger it becomes. Kind of like a gym bro that never skips arm day. For Monel 400, the main way to strengthen it is cold working, hammering, rolling, or pressing it at room temperature to squeeze the atoms closer together. Another type, Monel K500, gets an extra upgrade through precipitation hardening. That's when the metal is heated and cooled carefully.
to form tiny nickel-aluminum particles that reinforce it internally, like putting rebar in concrete. Even welding Monel is tricky. You can't just grab any filler rod. You need nickel-based ones that match its chemistry. If you weld it wrong, it'll warp or crack just to remind you who's boss. By the end of all this, you get a metal that's not only strong, but also weirdly graceful under pressure. The kind that stays calm while other alloys panic. Here's what makes Monel truly legendary. It doesn't just resist corrosion. It practically refuses to participate. Salt water shrugs it off. Steam? Whatever. Mild acids? Child's play. That's because nickel and copper form a solid solution, a perfectly blended atomic structure that prevents rust from even starting. Even stainless steel, which resists rust using a chromium oxide layer, can fail in harsh conditions. Monel, still shiny. It also keeps its strength in both scorching heat and freezing cold. Whether it's in an engine or the Arctic, Monel just says, cool story. But to be fair, it's not invincible. It can still corrode in oxidizing acids like nitric acid, and it can cause galvanic corrosion when touching other metals underwater. But overall, it's one of the toughest and most stable alloys humans have ever made. The metal equivalent of built different. So, to recap our metallic adventure, Monel is a nickel-copper alloy invented over a century ago that's nearly immune to corrosion, extreme heat, and bad moods. It's made by refining pure nickel and copper, melting and mixing them at high temperatures, and shaping or hardening them until they're practically unstoppable. It's the kind of metal that could take a vacation at the bottom of the ocean and come back looking refreshed. So next time you hear the name Mono, remember, it's not a perfume, not a pastry, and definitely not a Marvel villain. It's the metal that looked at rust and said, not today. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and that's the story of how humans created one of the most unbreakable, unstoppable, and unrustable metals ever. Also, if you have suggestions for our next video, feel free to share them in the comments below. We'll be sure to give you an acknowledgement for your contribution. If you enjoyed this video, please check out our other bingeable channels. Thank you for tuning in and join us next time here in the channel that answers all the why, what, who, where, and how questions you've always wondered about here on Explaining Everything.